I'm Brad Nessler, joined by the coach, Lee Corso, and the quarterback, Kirk Herbstreet. Today's game will be played in a controlled climate of a dome. So let's get set for the Clemson Tigers and the Cardinal of Stanford. I'm really looking forward to this one as it should be a very exciting bowl game. And here comes the Cardinal. If you compare these teams on paper, they really look to be pretty equal. Kirk, what do you think? Stanford has a sensational quarterback on their side who's a true leader. I think his presence on the field gives them a slight advantage. And Lee, I think that's going to be the difference in an extremely close game. Not so fast, my friend. Hey, guys, I'm going with the Tigers. Clemson has been waiting all week for this one. Get ready, folks. The opening kickoff is finally here. He kicks it. Number 30 fields it in the end zone. Little shake and bake move. This safety's a big-time player, but he's going to have to play his best game today. He faces a quarterback that can make you pay if you're not careful. I'm predicting an interception by this kid today. Ha! I like that. Kirk is making a call. Let's see if he picks off one before this game is over. Second and ten. Ball on the 33. Three-yard line. The defense will stack the line of scrimmage. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. Boy, he is one big guy down there on that defensive line. Oh, man, the big fella's a hoss. I saw him last night at the hotel, and he had three bags of food going up to his room. Yo, it looks like he's got a big old bag hanging over his belt right now. Number 13 has four receivers lined up here, rolling out to the left side. Finds his receiver. There's a missed tackle. And they make the stop on third and long. They get the first down, but was it close? Close or not, what a relief it is to the quarterback to have a new set of downs to work with. Stanford has just been dominant on offense. So far, so good. They've got themselves in the top ten in the country. All year long, these guys have been almost impossible to shut down when they're on the offensive side of the ball. A two-yard run by the halfback. Second and eight coming up here. This is the fifth play of this drive. They come out in a nickel. Drops back to pass. He lobs it out to the right. Has it to the senior. And the pass is caught, but he goes nowhere. Yeah, nice job there by the defense to get to him and make the sure tackle before he can make any moves to break loose. It's third down and five to go. Ball right around midfield. Back to pass. Steps up in the pocket. Over the middle. Got it to his receiver. First and ten. Ball on the 41. Six DBs in the lineup. He steps up. Wants to go long and does. Campbell brings him down. That was a big-time play and a new set of downs. I think the defense might have been thinking run there, Coach. Well, I don't blame him. It's pretty common to see a run on first and second down, but this offense is keeping them guessing. Cardinal with four receivers steps up. He's looking. He's got to throw it in a hurry. 
They get to the quarterback and end that play before it even got started. This young man didn't even have a chance to make something happen. It's tough to find your receivers when the defense is in your face like that. Look at how dominant they've been on defense. I'll tell you, as an offense, you've been pretty successful if you can even sniff the end zone against these guys. Whoa, they're one of the best in the country. Just look at those numbers. He drops back, steps up in the pocket, wants to throw outside, and this one's going to get intercepted. Looks to have been shaken up a bit on that play. Well, it doesn't look like it's too serious, guys, but you never know. Sometimes those small injuries turn into seizing-ending ones. They'll start this drive at the 25. Williams is back in the gun. He's going left. Incomplete pass. And he overthrew his wide receiver. I don't know too many seven-foot guys play football, so maybe he should aim lower the next time. So it's second and 10. Ball on their own 25. They'll work from the shotgun. The option left. And now he pitches it. He's on the run. Jennings with a takedown. What a play. Just a simple option play here. The quarterback gives it up, and they get good yardage. Great play. Boy, I tell you, this is impressive to see this offense when they're clicking. First and 10. Ball on the 38-yard line. The Tigers come out showing three wide. Drops back to pass. Let's it fly. Complete. He's got an opening. Martin brings him down. Nice decision by the quarterback. Not only was it good decision-making, but the offensive line protected just long enough for him to find his target. And when you combine the two, it'll be a first down nine out of ten times. Clemson lines up for the shotgun set. Williams on the option. Now he pitches it. Here's an opening. And he's tackled. A nice pickup of about eight yards. It's second down and two to go. And this is the fifth play of the current drive. They come out in a nickel. Back to pass. He steps up, throws it out there. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. Loss of two. Third and four. And this is the sixth play of the drive. Clemson comes out of the shotgun. Here's the option. They'll drop him for a loss. He got nothing on that play. The defense is really digging in now, you guys. The Tigers come out in the ace formation. Play action. Looking. Home run ball in the air. The ball is tipped. That was a calculated risk there, don't you think? Yeah, I think it was. Sometimes you have too much confidence in your offense, and it cost them there as they turned it over on downs. They'll take over at the 35. They'll work from the shotgun. Steps up, looks, throws this one out to the right. Incomplete. He had it knocked loose before he could control it. Just a great play here by the defender to force the issue. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on their own 35. The Cardinal with four receivers gets rid of it quickly. Way to look it in. Five-yard loss on the play. Third and 15 coming up. Ball on the 30. Six DBs in the lineup. Steps up in the pocket. The ball is tipped. Oh, he had a shot at the pick. Good defense there, guys. I wonder if the quarterback was expecting to see man coverage there because he threw it right to the defense. And that's what's so tough about playing against the zone. You think a guy's open, and out of nowhere, a defender shows up. Just like that. They line up to punt this one away. Jackson gets it off. 
Henry takes it to 28. Across midfield, at the 40, at the 30, to the 20, to the 10. Goodbye! What a huge return! Did you see how he accelerated through that hole? And once he hit the open field, it was just pure speed. Yeah, talking to this coach, this is the player that he was afraid of for all the reasons you mentioned. Speed and acceleration. And he tacks on the extra point. Over two minutes remaining in the first quarter. The score is Clemson, seven. Stanford, nothing. Kick looks to be returnable. Kelly passes it at the five. At the 30, he jukes. The defense did a nice job of shutting down this offense the last time they had the ball. The offense was not clicking at all. Let's see if they're back on the same page. They'll get the ball here at the 38. At the 38 yard line. First and 10. Carter lines up in the shotgun. He's under pressure. Short talk. Got it to the senior. The play fake, good for only a couple. Second and eight coming up here. Ball on the 40-yard line. The Cardinal line up with three wide. Comes across the middle. Oh, great catch. Tackle. I like the defense that was called. They just didn't make the play on the ball. You're right. It wasn't necessarily bad defense. The offense just executed, and the result was a first down. First and 10. Ball on the 42. They come out with three wide receivers. He's looking. He's going left. And he pulls it down. Way to look it in. Nice catch. Sure was. He displayed some great hands there. Now we're looking at a first down. It's first and 10, ball on the 20 yard line. Ball on the 20 yard line. Four wide, they'll throw on first down. Looking, throws this one out to the left. Finds a man. Nice decision by the quarterback. Not only was it good decision making, but the offensive line protected just long enough for him to find his target. And when you combine the two, it'll be a first down nine out of 10 times. So they're back in the red zone where they threw a pick on their last visit. McKenzie with a takedown. Stanford lines up in a shotgun set. A little juke. Touchdown, Stanford! And the halfback took it in for the score. That young man is proven to be a valuable member of this squad. And if he keeps running like that, he'll find himself in the end zone a lot. the PAT. Time to take a look at the Pontiac Drive Summary. And remember, the good folks at Pontiac have been bringing you fuel for the soul since 1926. Looks like they're ready for the kick. Kicks it off. 
you got to keep the kick in bounds. Here's the ref's call. Illegal procedure on the kicking team. The ball will be spotted at the 35 yard line. They'll be set up with good field position after the kicker sent that one out of bounds. It's the kicker's job to send that ball deep, so he messed up big time. They'll go to work at the 35 yard line. They come out at a nickel. And down he goes. A seven yard play. Second and three coming up. Ball on the 42. Going with the shotgun here. And he stopped behind the line. They get a one yard loss on that one. It's third down and four to go. Ball on their own 41. They come out with four wide out. Cook, the ball carrier. Here's an opening. Brought down. And that was a nice run. Kirk, that was a great job by that big offensive line. Yeah, it really was, Brad. And also, a nice read by the ball carrier to find that running lane. When you break one like that, you got to give a lot of credit to the offensive line. First, First and ten. ten. Ball right around midfield. Oh. Williams. Back in the gun, he steps up, looks, he passes it, got it, it's on the ground, and the quarterback comes in and scoops up the fumble. A nice recovery there by the quarterback. He's used to going after interceptions, but a turnover is a turnover, and he'll take it any way he can get it. I couldn't agree with you more, Coach. Thanks, Kirk. That's what I like to hear. Anytime. They'll start this drive at the 27. 27 yard line. Stanford comes to the line with three wide. He's gobbled up in the backfield. And they snuffed out the quarterback draw there. Yep. There was absolutely nowhere for the quarterback to run on that play. Good job by this defense. Second down, 14 coming up here. Ball on their own 23, number 13, with four wide receivers. Drops back to pass. He lobs it out to the left side. They'll drop him for a loss. Loss of three. down and a couple miles here. Ball on the 20-yard line. Number 13 lines up in the shotgun. He's looking. He's looking for his man. And that one's fallen incomplete. He had his wide out, but he couldn't hit him. When he misses, it's usually high. And that's something he's been working very hard with his coach on. The Cardinal are lining up the punt it away. It's off, and it is a dandy. Henry takes it to 36. The last time they had the ball, they gave it away on the fumble. The old ball coach was not too happy about that either. I'd hate to see that if it happens again. They'll take over at the 41. First and 10. The Tigers line up with four wide out. Williams brings him down for a loss. Look at that. The Blitz just threw off their blocking assignments. And that's why this running back is looking for his mouthpiece right now. It's second down now and 13 to go. Ball on their own 38. They'll work from the shotgun. He drops back. Throws. And it's caught. And he's taken down. Four yards gained. Third and nine coming up. Ball on the 42. They'll work from the shotgun. 
He's going right. Got it. They knock him out, but not before he gets all the way down to the 25. They made the third down conversion look too easy. They were just looking for the first and ended up getting a huge chunk of yardage. It's not bad. First and 10, ball in the 25. Clemson lines up in a shotgun set. Looking, he might not be able to get the pass off. Found his man. I like the defense that was called. They just didn't make the play on the ball. You're right. It wasn't necessarily bad defense. The offense just executed, and the result is a first down. Well, Lee, it's their first trip to the red zone today, and they haven't really done very well so far this season. Yeah, but my friend, today is a new day. Let's see if they can get him across the goal line and light up the scoreboard. They'll throw on first down. That was a well-drawn-up play for the wideout. Yeah, they saw something upstairs. It led to a touchdown. You can thank the play calling there. Very impressive. And he tacks on the extra point. Time to take a look at the Pontiac Drive Summary. And remember, the good folks at Pontiac have been bringing you fuel for the soul since 1926. Phillips, ready to kick. And they'll be returning this one. Number 30, fields it at the three. And they threw a flag on that play. Let's see what the call is. Got an interview the face mask on the defense. He wasn't careful enough and got a hand on the guy's face mask. That will go as a five-yard penalty for grabbing his face mask. It's first and ten. Ball on the 27. First and ten. Number 13. He's back in the gun. Look. Look out. And it's caught. He's all the way down to the 36-yard line. First and ten. Ball on the 36. They'll work from the shotgun. Steps up. He's looking. Across the middle. A hard throw, and it was dropped. He possibly could have taken something off that one, but hey, when you throw that way, your receiver still can make the catch. You're one step away from the big leagues, right, Coach? Kirk, you're absolutely right. The great ones will catch anything. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 36-yard line. Number 13 has four receivers lined up here. Looking. He's looking deep down the left side. Someone got a hand on it. And it falls incomplete. Third and 10. Ball on the 36. The Cardinal set up in the gun. Looks, lets it go. Do they have that defense guessing now or what? I mean, did you see how well the quarterback hit the ball? Yeah, some quarterbacks are just so good at selling the play action. It's truly an overlooked skill. You take my friend Kirk here, for example. He wasn't known for his speed, but boy, he could do a good play fake. Are you calling me slow? This is coming from a guy whose nickname is based on his foot speed. Isn't that right, Scooter? Yeah. Left out Sunshine. It's Sunshine Scooter, sweetheart. 
and he hits the PAT. Here's the Pontiac Drive Summary, bringing you fuel for the soul. it off. Henry fields it at the two. Well, the offense heading back out onto the field after that kick, hoping to turn this drive into another touchdown. It's first and ten. Ball on their own 26. First and ten. The Tigers come out in the ace formation. Throws. Complete. And they make the stop. Way to look it in. Nice catch. Sure was. He displayed some great hands there. Now we're looking at a first down. First and ten. Ball on their own 44. Clemson comes to the line with three wide. They'll throw on first down. He tosses it short. Number 10, the intended receiver on the play. So it's second and 10. Ball on the 44. The Tigers have five receivers on this play. Back to pass with a quick throw, and it's caught. And they push him out. The defense looked a little lost on that one, Kirk. Yeah, they did, Brad. Nice recognition here by the quarterback to see that confusion and then take advantage of it. It's third down in the yard for the first down. Ball on the 47-yard line. They come out in a nickel the ground with the tailback. He lost the ball, and the defense picks it up. There he goes. Williams brings him down, and the defense got on it quickly. That was a heck of a play by the big man. Sure was, Kirk. It's not too often those big linemen get their hands on a football. Boy, is he excited. On the right side of the 50 as they start this drive. And they hit him in the backfield. Second and 13 coming up here. Ball of the 29. And the impact linebacker has turned it up a notch. He's hit and got away. Smith with a monster hit. Great. It's third down and seven to go. Ball in the 23. Stanford lines up for the shotgun set. Steps up in the pocket. And he's hammered as he lets it go. Even a great adjustment wouldn't have made a difference on that low throw. His shoelaces need a pair of hands for that pass. Here we go. They'll try to make this a field goal game. He gets it up. No good. He missed it to the right. They'll get the ball here at the 23-yard line. Clemson comes out with five receivers. 
Williams drops back. He lobs it left. Complete. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. Clemson calls a timeout. Second down, 14 coming up here. Ball on the 19. Five wide. Williams, back to pass. He rolls out to the left. He's looking. He unloads it. It falls incomplete, and he overthrew his wide receiver. I don't know too many seven-foot guys play football, so maybe he should aim lower the next time. It's third down and 14 to go. Ball on the 19-yard line. The Tigers come to the line with their jumbo package. Ready to put this one away. Number 81 punts it, and it's a good one. Number 30 fields it at the 22. This one might be coming back, folks. Let's check out the penalty. Clipping on the receiving team. That one will put the offense in a hole, and they'll try to get some of that back on this upcoming play. Just a minute to go in the first half of play. Now's not the time for a blown coverage. This quarterback is in the zone. Drops back to pass. Throw short. And it's caught. Only three yards there on the throw. Second, Second and seven. seven coming up here. Ball, Ball on their own 16. The Cardinal with four receivers. He drops back. He steps up, throws this one out to the right. The ball is tipped. Great defensive play by the cornerback. It's third down and seven to go. Ball on the 16-yard line. Going with the shotgun here. A handoff. Aiken Dona brings him down. Clemson calls a timeout. Henry is deep to receive, and something tells me he's looking for a second return. It's away, and it's a booming punt. Henry fields it at the 37. So before the offense hits the field, let's take the time to let you know that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. They'll go to work at the 45. The Tigers have five receivers on this play. Back to pass. He throws it. Complete. They'll drop him for a loss. Nothing going on that one. Spikes the ball. It's third down and 10. Ball of the 45. They'll work from the shotgun. Williams steps back to pass. Looking, he gets the pass away. Breaks one. The ball came free. And they fall on the loose ball. He's going to come out. It looks like he was hurt on that last play. Yeah, I don't think it's too serious, though, guys. He's a tough athlete. I think we'll see him back in this game. They'll 
set up shot at the 37. The Cardinal set up in the gun. Steps up, throw short, incomplete pass. And he overthrew his wide receiver. I don't know too many seven-foot guys played football, so maybe he should aim lower the next time. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 37-yard line. And the defensive end is looking to make a play. Look, bat it away. Nice job to get up and knock it down at the line. Yeah, the defensive end got in the passing lane and batted the ball away. Third and ten. Ball on their own 37. The Cardinal with four receivers. Drops back to pass. Steps up in the pocket. Waits till the last moment. Found his man. He ignores the footsteps and makes the catch. Stanford takes a timeout. It's first and ten. Ball on the 47. Number 13 has five receivers lined up here. He drops back. He steps up. He's looking. Fires deep down the right side. And they couldn't hook up on that one. And we'll go into halftime here with a score all deadlocked. Second half just about set to get underway as the teams line up for the kick. Decent kick, looks to be returnable. Henry fields it at the three. Bounces off the would-be tackler. What is he doing? Come on, you gotta make someone miss. Yeah, that was not a very good return. They'll take over at the 17-yard line. Clemson lines up in a shotgun set. Back to pass. Comes across the middle. His receiver has it. And he's taken down at the 29. Nice decision by the quarterback. Not only was it good decision making, but the offensive line protected just long enough for him to find his target. And when you combine the two, it'll be a first down nine out of ten times. First and ten. Ball of the 29. Clemson goes with the ace set here. And they try to set up a screen. And it's caught. Knocked out of bounds. And it looks like there's an injury down there on the field. Second and six coming up here. Ball on their own 33. Single set back to you. Drops back to pass. He spins around. They'll bring him down. He scrambled and maybe picked up a yard there. Third and five. Ball on the 34. Williams with three wide receivers. Missed tackle. Tackle. Well, Kirky managed to get enough there to move the chains. Yep, that's a great effort there by the running back to be able to get the ball upfield and pick up another valuable first down. First it's first and ten. Ball, ball on the 40. Clemson comes out with five receivers. He's going to go for the home run. And he got it! Now that was a good-looking play. The quarterback put it where his receiver could get it, and now they have a first down. What I like is the faith that this quarterback has in his receiver. He's not afraid to throw it downfield. First and 10, ball on the 27. The Tiger set up in the gun. Steps up. He'll dump this one off. The ball is knocked to the ground. Players use anything they can to get in the way of a pass. 
So it's second and 10. And this is the seventh play of the current drive. The Tiger come out in the ace formation. Williams fakes a handoff with the throw. Big opening. Porter with a takedown. I like the defense that was called. They just didn't make the play on the ball. You're right. It wasn't necessarily bad defense. The offense just executed, and the result is a first down. Have a look at our Old Spice red zone numbers. Red zone, when performance matters the most. They line up in the shotgun. It's a direct snap. Makes a move. Brought down. Maybe a yard on the run by the tailback. On the 12, and they can smell the goal line. Williams lines up in the shotgun. He's looking down the middle, and it falls incomplete. About 12 yards out. And the defensive tackle's looking to cause some chaos. He drops back, steps up in the pocket, looking. Here they come. Jenning comes away with a sack. Under relentless pressure, the quarterback goes down for the sack. Those guys on defense are just pinning their ears back right now, coming in as fast as they can. Well, in that case, the offense needs to sneak in a screen pass to the head. Let him get behind the rush and then take off behind his blockers for six. Here comes the kicker. He'll try to put his team up by a field goal. The kick is up, and it splits the uprights. And now let's take a look at the drive summary brought to you by Pontiac. Clemson lines up for the kickoff. Kelly and number 30 back ready to return. Kicks it deep. Kelly fields it in the end zone. So before the offense hits the field, let's take the time to let you know that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. They'll get the ball here at the 17. They come out with four wideouts. They'll throw on first down. Complete, and down he goes. They just took what the defense gave them on that play. Yeah, you're right. That was a good job of getting that pass completed for positive yardage. This offense might be behind now, but at least they've stayed away from that safety back there. He doesn't have any picks and hardly any deflections or tackles. That's really not like him at all. Usually he's making the highlight reel, whether it's a big hit or a key interception. We haven't seen him do that today. No, and that's not like him at all. Usually he's a big-time player. Third and six. Ball on their own 21. Number 13, back in the gun. Looks, throws this one out to the left. It falls incomplete. The wide receiver wasn't able to hang on. You talk about a solid hit. This guy is a true enforcer. Stanford, ready to put this one away. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. Henry fields it at the 34. Time once again for this offense to come back out and start another drive. They'll go to work at the 40-yard line. First and 10. Clemson comes out in the shotgun. And he's taken down. 
Eight yards on the pickup. Second and two coming up here. Ball right around midfield. Ace backfield. Henry on the handoff. Brought down. He picks up a yard on the play. It's third down and a yard for the first down. Ball right around midfield. They go with the option. Martin brings him down. And they convert on third down with the old option. Yep, that didn't get them many yards, but it'll keep the drive alive. First and ten. Ball on the 50. Williams lines up in the shotgun. Throws it to the outside. Batted ball. Almost picked off. That could have been a big play for the defense. Yeah, even though he had a good shot at picking it off, it's still a heck of a play to force the incomplete pass. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 50. Clemson lines up for the shotgun set. Williams drops the throw. It's deflected. The defense needed that one. How about the move here by this cornerback? Great play that time, getting a hand on the football. The offense faces another third down as they line it up. The Tiger with four receivers. Williams set to go to the air. Throw short, incomplete. He was looking for his running back, but the pass just sailed on it. They line up to punt this one away. He gets it away, and it's a skyrocket. Number 30 falls for the fair catch. He hauls it in at the 13. Time once again for this offense to come back out and start another drive. They'll start this drive at the 13-yard line. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. He jukes it. Campbell with a takedown. That'll be a gain of five. It's second down and five to go. Ball on the 18-yard line. From the gun, back to pass. He steps up, wants to throw outside. Ball's loose. First and ten. Ball on their own 39. Stanford lines up with three receivers. Across the middle. The senior makes the catch. And we got an injured player on the field. It's second down and three to go. Ball on their own 46. Number 13, back in the gun. Throw short, and it's caught, and down he goes. And the completion nets some very little yardage. Coach, what's up with that play? I'll tell you, those defenders crashed in and got him in a hurry. No chance to get anything there. Third and two coming up here. Ball on the 47. And if anyone can make a play on defense, it's the defensive end down there. Henry, back to return, and he's already proven he can break these with a block or two. Only a field goal separates these two teams as we move to the fourth quarter. The Cardinals line up the punt. It's away, and it's a booming punt. 
Henry fields it at the 13. I don't know if you guys saw this, but the coach gave his offense quite a speech before he sent him out there. And let's not forget, they had some things clicking the last time out. He's probably just reminding them to finish the job this time. They'll set up shop at the 20-yard line. The Tiger set up in the gun. Steps up, throws short. McKinley drops the ball. This incompletion is credited to the wideout. Absolutely. The quarterback executed his end of the deal. In second down and 10 to go. Ball on their own 20. Williams with three wide receivers. He can scoop. Porter brings him down. I think this offensive line is getting better and better as the game goes along. And coach, I'll tell you what, I think they're killing the will of this defense. And I don't think they're done just yet. First and 10, ball on the 37. Williams has five receivers lined up here. And that defense is getting a little excited down there. Offsides. Defense. The defense lends them a hand with that penalty. Gosh, giving up penalty yards is so frustrating, isn't it? First down and five to go. Ball on the 42-yard line. Williams, back to pass. Steps up in the pocket. Throws this one out to the left. They'll bring him down. That was a big time play and a new set of down. I think the defense might have been thick and run there, coach. Well, I don't blame him. It's pretty common to see a run on first and second down, but this offense is keeping them guessing. First and 10. Ball on the 31. Six DBs in the lineup. Throw. Complete. So they get about four yards from play action. Second and six coming up here. Ball on the 27-yard line. Clemson comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. He tosses it short, and it's gone. And they make the stop. Way to look it in. Nice catch. Sure was. He displayed some great hands there. Now we're looking at a first down. The pressure turns up when in the red zone, and that's when you turn to Old Spice Red Zone, when performance matters the most. The kicker got them points on their last red zone visit. Let's see if the offense can get points this time. He may have gotten back to the line of scrimmage. Williams is back in the gun. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. Touchdown, Clemson! He got the handoff and knew exactly what to do with it. They like the fact that they have a halfback who can kick his way so well through defense. Tacks on the extra point. Here's the drive summary brought to you by Pontiac. Clemson to kick, number 30, and Kelly back to return. He kicks it. Number 30, fields it at the three. They're just about ready to get this drive started. After their last series, had some promise, but it ended with a punt. They'll take over at the 19. First and 10. 
The Cardinal come out the shotgun. He steps up. He's looking. And he's going to be sacked for a loss. The quarterback had nowhere to go, and he's brought down for the sack. They've got to do a better job up front with their pass protection. If they don't start picking up everybody, then this quarterback is going to be pretty sore in the morning. That's for sure. The Cardinal with four receivers throws it to the outside. Complete on the run. And he's all the way down to the 43-yard line. Wow, nice catch. Way to look at him. Heck of a job by the wide receiver. These guys are moving the ball down the field. It's first and 10. Ball on the 43-yard line. The Cardinal line up with four wideouts. Throws. And it's incomplete, and he overthrew his wide receiver. I don't know too many seven-foot guys play football, so maybe he should aim lower the next time. Second and 10, ball on the 43. Nickel defense, drops back to pass, throws to the middle, got it, and down he goes. Nice decision by the quarterback. Not only was it good decision making, but the offensive line protected just long enough for him to find his target. And when you combine the two, it'll be a first down nine out of ten times. It's first and ten, and this is the fifth play of the current drive. They'll bring in their dime package. They'll throw on first down. Throws in a hurry. Touchdown, Stanford! Wow, an almost impossible pass to defend, and it goes for six. Yep, the defense would have needed 12 guys on the field that time. the PAT. Time to take a look at the drive summary. It's brought to you by Pontiac. Fuel for the soul. Stanford is ready to kick it away. Henry and number 11 deep to return. Here's the kick. Henry fields it at the two. They moved the ball very effectively on their last drive, which ended with a touchdown. The defense has been talking it over on the sideline, trying to make some corrections. Let's see if they can stop them this time. They'll go to work at the 29. The Tigers come out in the ace formation. Henry, the ball carrier, tackle. He got back to the line of scrimmage, but not much more. Second and 10, ball in the 29. Clemson comes out in the shotgun. Williams sets up the play action. Complete. And he's tackled. I like the defense that was called. They just didn't make the play on the ball. You're right. It wasn't necessarily bad defense. The offense just executed, and the result is a first down. It's first and 10. Ball on the 49. The Tigers with four receivers. Throws. Complete. They'll bring him down. Nowhere to go on that play action pass completion. Second and nine coming up here. Ball on the 48. Clemson comes to the line with three wide. Cut. 
Williams drops back to pass. Throws it to the outside. Couldn't haul it in. Oh, he could have had a big reception that time, guys. Just let that one get away from his vision just for a split second. It's third down and nine to go. This is the fifth play of this drive. Williams lines up in the shotgun. Looking. He's going to air it long. Caught. Great concentration. I know I've said this all week, but I like this kid's arm. He's got good mechanics and a nice touch of the ball. He's not doing bad in this game either, my friend. Not bad is right, Lee. That last pass gives him over 300 yards on the day. And we take a quick look at the stats from within the red zone, brought to you by Old Spice Red Zone, when performance matters the most. Clemson comes out with five receivers. He drops back. He lets it go, and it's caught. And they hit him in the backfield. Five-yard loss on the play. Stanford calls a timeout. It's second and goal. Ball on the 13. The defense lines up with six DBs. Henry gets another carry. Spin move. And he's taken down. The Cardinal are going to take a timeout, and they'll have one timeout left. Clemson comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. Throw short. It's deflected. Number 33 picks it off, and he might take this at the 40. And they'll return this one all the way. Goodbye. This defense just warms to a pass and a throw like that. That's because of two things. Fresh one of quarterbacks and being in a throw defense. Everybody can see the play. And if you don't throw a pass and ball, a score the other way in a big time hurry. And he tacks on the extra point. So with less than two to go in the fourth quarter, the score is Stanford 28, Clemson 24. Stanford to kick. Henry back deep to return. And he got all of this one. Great kick. Henry fields it in the end zone. Defense won the last battle as they were able to pick the ball off. Who's going to win this time? They'll get the ball here at the 17 yard line. The Tigers line up with five receivers. Williams to the air on first down. He's going left. Dropped by the wideout. The intended receiver on the play. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 17-yard line. Six DBs in the lineup. Williams drops to throw, and he's throwing long, and he's got a man out there. And he overthrew his wide receiver. I don't know too many seven-foot guys play football, so maybe he should aim lower the next time. Three. 
Third and ten. Ball on the 17. Clemson in a five wide set. He throws a dart to the left. Complete. And they got him for a loss. A one yard loss. the stop. Clemson takes a timeout. It's first and ten. Ball on the 36-yard line. They come out in a nickel. Williams to the air on first down. Looks. Throws this one out to the left. That could have easily been a turnover. Yeah, I don't even think the quarterback even saw that guy. Well, he almost saw him running the other direction with the football. Second and ten. Ball on their own 36. They'll bring in their dime package. Drops back to pass. He's rolling right. He's looking. He zips it out. Comes up with a jump ball. Clemson calls a timeout. It's first and ten. Ball on the 25. He drops back, throws it to the outside. It falls incomplete. So it's second and 10. Ball on the 25 yard line. Going with the shotgun here. Back to pass. Let's it fly. And it's caught. They'll bring him down. Well, Coach, a short pickup on that pass play. It was, but you know what? As long as they've got those guys getting open underneath, it'll take a lot of pressure off those offensive linemen who are trying to hold their blocks. William will throw for it, and he dropped it. The pass was right there. Just couldn't be controlled. This tied in some more passes in practice. He needs all the help he can get. Defense lines up with six DB. Jenny with a monster hit. They went for it, but they were denied. Well, that was a situation where they had to go for it. I agree. They can't afford to let the other team hold on to the ball. The time is ticking away. It's first and ten. Ball on the 20-yard line. And this should be a kneel down as they just try to kill the clock. There's the kneel down by the quarterback. Clemson takes a timeout. Second down and 12. Ball on the 18. Number 13 is in the zone and looking to make a play. coming up here. Ball on their own 16. Number 13 is the impact player and he's feeling it right now. And that's the end of the ball game. Any final thoughts on this one, Coach? Well, this one had me on the edge of my seat all game long. Stanford really got all they asked for and more in this contest. Great job by both teams. 
Well, that'll wrap up another chapter in NCAA football 2006. And our final count, Stanford 28, Clemson 24. This is Brad Nessler for Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreit saying so long.